Hello everybody out here on YouTube. It is I here with Beautiful Beauty. Okay guys, hang on. Let's start out with taking a big drink. We're going to be doing a product review. We're going to be talking about feminine cleansers. We're going to be talking about vaginal cleansers. Drink time. Hang on guys. Okay, so I am huffing and puffing. I am, I don't know, I'm all over the place. Been doing a lot of work, like running upstairs, downstairs, working. I just started a load of laundry. Let's talk about this stuff. I really do like this. Now, if you are familiar with my channel, um, you know that I like to buy and try various different brands and kinds of feminine washes. Um, you know, I mean, yes, things like Summer's Eve and Massengill and all your typical brands like that are okay. Um, and I used to actually really like the Equate brand. They seem to do a little bit of a reformulation and it kind of like burns and stings. And uh, yeah, you know what I'm talking about. And the dollar stores sell really great ones. I mean, like uh, Dollar Tree, Family Dollar, and the 99 cents only store sell really good feminine washes uh five below sells a really good one as well i used a few months ago but anyhow i buy and try all kinds and i like to buy a lot of them from amazon and vitacost and wherever oh and i really like the um the one i did a product review on recently you guys what's it called what's it called uh mama medicine medicine mama i think it's called medicine mama that's really great I got that from Vitacost.com. Okay, anyhow, moving on to talk about this formulation. I got this one from Target. I really do like it. This one is like um, a foam consistency. Now, I have had a little bit of an issue with some of the uh, feminine cleansers that are in the foam form of being foam. Does that make sense? No, probably not. Probably snot. <laughs> you know what I mean? Um, I've had a little bit of an issue. Like one of the foam cleansers, I think that was actually a Summer's Eve one. Um, I felt like it was incomplete. It would like incompletely clean you. It would, it would cleanse you a little bit, but not enough. Does that make sense? You didn't feel as clean as you should. You didn't feel as fresh as you should downstairs. You know what I'm talking about? Um, I really like this one though. This one does definitely give a clean feeling, a cleansed, clean feeling. Not like you've kind of halfway cleansed yourself, but like you've cleansed yourself. You know what I mean? Does that make sense? I know that was my issue with one of the other foam cleansers before about, maybe that was a year ago. I remember that. I did not like that one. I like this one. This is the brand, the Queen V brand. Um, I've done a product review on like the bubble bath type of product that they make. Uh, it comes in the pink like rubbery bottle. I really like that. But anyhow, this is a foam cleanser. I like it. So this is what it's called. This is the Queen V. Um, it says make it rain body wash. Okay, it has green tea. It has mango and chamomile extracts. It is cruelty free, which I absolutely love that. It says gynecological, um, gynecologist recommended. It is paraben and dye free, which is very important. I love that. It is pH balance. And the formulation here is called, what's it called? I thought it was gonna have like a, a, a fragrance. You know, not, not like a fragrance, but yeah, that's what I meant. You know what I mean? Uh, you know what I mean? Does that make sense? <laughs> you know, I like tropical rain or whatever. You know what I mean? A flavor, a fragrance. Yeah. Kind of like get confused talking about shampoos. You know what I mean? Because I always describe the smell of shampoos, you know? Um, I have a crazy bad scent sensitivity issue. So I just, I'm getting off track. I know I am. I know I am. Anyhow, this is five fluid ounces and it says maintain your V. Okay. So if you are a woman, you guys, honestly, nothing better than being a woman um i know that like when you're a, a tween and a young teenager you know it's like oh you know it's really not so fun to be a woman you know you're really coming into your own you're feeling life out you're feeling things out you don't exactly enjoy being a woman till you get out of your teens does that make sense um, you know, I'm not trying to be offending to anybody out here because I know you guys, a lot of my viewers are teens and I absolutely love you guys. But, um, you know, it's all about being positive and making that positive impact. And I get a ton of questions 
on my feminine wash videos from some very young viewers and nothing I love better than to be able to share information or knowledge with you guys but you know what I'm saying is I myself personally I remember being that that age you know of a of a of a tween and then a teen it's like oh you're a woman you know and a, you know it's so much goes along with it but once you get the hang of what it's like to be a girl what it's like being a woman you know what I mean like you hit the ground running so I I once I got basically out of high school and into college it was like I hit the ground running you guys you know what I mean it's like I truly think that I started to enjoy being a woman instead of it like being a hassle because you know it's like being a hassle you got to go through PMS you know and you got to get used to PMS you got to get used to a monthly period you got to get used to your breast you know you know, you know what I mean not getting super uber graphic here but you got to get used to being a girl and once you do it is fun so it's like enjoy being a woman you know um, I love this stuff. Let me see if I can try to describe the smell of it. I'm looking on the bottle here because I'm trying to figure out what the fragrance would be referenced to, but I don't really see anything. Yeah, it just, it says Queen V, it just says Queen V Make It Rain Body Wash. It doesn't give an actual, like, you know, fragrance description. Okay, let me see if I can describe it. It definitely has a smell to it, but it's, I can't describe it you guys it's like this ocean fresh type of smell I guess it definitely smells soapy it has like this ocean freshness to it um, I absolutely love it and I will say this um, not only does it work great as um, a cleanser down there it's also a body wash as well it really does well of scrubbing up the butt you know you got to scrub the back end uh, typically when you're using feminine wash you guys start with the front first move to the back um, just because the way germs migrate and mitigate and the way the woman's body works wash your front first and then your back end okay um, and it's, it's just like this great scientific you know what I mean there's all stuff to it you know uh, <laughs> I was gonna say something else but you know anyways um, whatever you do you do it to the front first and then you move to the back so wash your front first which is your vaginal area first then wash the bootay your back end and the anal area and all that good fun stuff back there you know talking about um, gotta kind of watch your own words you know kind of monitor yourself and be your own moderator here because you know, I know a lot of these videos here on YouTube, I mean, they get pulled off for various reasons. And sometimes you really kind of got to eggshell your words, you know, like walk around on eggshells. And uh, you have to th stop and think, hey, you know, is this video going to get pulled? But why? You know, I'm not showing anything graphic. I'm not being too descriptive or too, you know, graphic with my words or anything like that. Or, you know, bad language or anything like that. I never use bad language in my videos, you guys. There is absolutely no reason or no purpose. And I feel that, I mean, why would, you don't have to click on somebody's video to hear like cussing and things like that, you know, I don't know. But anyhow, uh, it's just like an, it's like an immature thing, you know, I just, yeah. But you know, hey, I click on people's videos, you know, and I, I mean, I don't, I don't, I mean, I watch some really bad movies, you guys, you know, bad language, horror movies, whatever. And I love that stuff, but when I put a movie on, I expect that. But when I click on somebody's video, you know, and they're like, I don't know, 45, 50, 60 years old, and they're, you know, they're ranting and raving and they're cussing and they're, you know, oh. and I'm like, yeah. If I'm going to watch a movie, I get that. I know what to expect, like some rated R movie or whatever, you know, and I know what I'm getting. But if I click on somebody's video and I don't know, I just don't want to sit there and waste my time listening to foul language, you know. I know I'm super off subject but I'm just talking now we're just chit chatting so I will definitely label this video as a product review as well as a little chit in a chat so I love this stuff though and it has like this ocean breezy type of smell to it it's not super overpowering or anything like that you know it's not it's not as smelly as like a basic body wash would be not like you know say a suave body wash or a dial brand body wash or, or caress or something like that it's not as fragranced as that but also before i let you guys go i'm going to show you the ingredients real quick that's always super important i want you to know um what you're buying what you're getting what you're looking at you know straight up straight up straight up truth honesty i think that's a song isn't it yeah straight up that's a song there are the ingredients
Okay, and I hope that gives you guys a little bit of an idea. But, um, you know, like I said, if you are familiar with these foam washes, you know, I've talked about them before in the past. Usually, I don't really care for the foam for the feminine uh, washes, but this one's really good. So, obviously, instructionals here, you know, little instructions, you know, in case you don't know how to use it, you know, because somebody's always going to ask me exactly how do you use it. Try to do this without being, you know, against the guidelines, rules, and regulations of YouTube here, you know what I mean? So, but anyhow, obviously, wet your skin, wet downstairs, the vaginal area, you're in the shower. I really love showers, you guys, because I get cleaner with showers. I take baths maybe once a month, so it's not very often. But anyhow, if you're a bath person, same scenario here, it doesn't matter. You obviously wet downstairs, and you take a nice big a poof of it. Let me show you. I actually pump it out here okay so that's not enough really literally so another pump here okay two pumps I'm good to go this is enough to cleanse downstairs and then once I get done cleansing the vaginal area which is the front I always refer to it as front just because you never know who's looking and listening here so after I get done cleansing the front, rinse off, and then I move to the back, which is another two pumps for the back, and then uh, I switch off to like regular bar soap and things like that, you know, like buns and buttocks and thighs and thighs and fun and tummy and yeah, whatever. <laughs> okay, <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> Sometimes you can't really say what you want to say because we are so watched, you know what I mean? But um, just trying to be helpful, be as descriptive as I can. But yeah, I love this stuff. Absolutely love it. Definitely recommend it. Now I got a big blob on my hand. Uh, gonna go rinse my hand off here. Enjoy the rest of your day. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye, gorgeous.